is Geo7 here, and whilst editing I just realised I forgot to put the intro in, this is just going to be the ultimate defending strategy, the perfect defending strategy, I um, just forgot to add it in at the start, or it might cut out, I can't remember now because it was recorded a time ago, but anyway guys, let's get into the video. Today's video is all about defending, and the perfect defending on ultimate team, as you can see, I've got my team set up with a Kante and a Casemiro playing in the midfield. They're the two sort of players that you do want to be playing. You could potentially get Renato Sanchez playing instead of that Casemiro because he is another player that will do the job for you. But Casemiro definitely is a decent player at doing that job. I definitely recommend using him. So guys, you can see that his attack is in fact got Vardy, Martial, Sterling. So what you want to be looking at is trying to get Kante to run back and hold out them three attackers. That will be the idea of this defend. So guys, let's get underway, and you can see that I'm in Division Three. I'm in Division Three as such because I, well, I, I wanted to play in Division Three because hopefully there'll be some attacking against me, as much as I am pretty good for the Division Three. So first of all, you see the attack, and you don't want to control your defenders, and then it's an easy challenge for Mike for Casemiro to get away. The main purpose is to not control defenders and run back with your central midfielders. So Neymar is coming back, so we'll use Neymar at this point. And then... So he's just running the ball around, and as long as you keep holding your midfielders, they're not going to be able to get through. And then if they do get through, then you can shield off. It shouldn't be too much of a challenge to shield off with your defenders by the time they get there, if you've done the job right with the midfielders. Obviously, I'm not the best of the game, and this is down to just how good you are at playing more than anything else. Oh. So, so I was controlling David Luiza. You don't really want to be controlling David Luiza. Oh, that's bad for me. That wasn't the perfect defending, was it? <sighs> That's just a rookie error passing the ball out from the back. So here we go again. It's Jamie Vardy, and you want to just control N'Golo Kante. So if you've used N'Golo Kante and don't think he's that good, it's probably because you're not using him in the same way, in the right way that you should be using him in terms of his defending. The idea is to pretty much control your defenders as minimum as possible because they'll put the tackles in, they'll be the ones to get the ball away. And that is why this is the perfect defending. And that Casemiro can get up, nearly scores there. But I'm not sure, sure yet if I'm gonna, how much I'm going to edit this down or not. So I done a bad error there because I came out with Louise. That is not the right defending. Because you want to, because if you, they'll just hold their line of defenders. Yeah, they'll just hold their line. So in fact, it'll. If you just run back with the defend the midfielders, then the defenders hold the line. And if they do try to get through, they should just put the challenge in for you without you having to do anything, which obviously has less chance of it failing, like it would do if you're the one doing it. Oh, I should have shot. Hey guys, as you can see, that was a decent strategy. It's a strategy that most pro players probably use. I think they do use it, and it's a strategy that you're most likely to come off tops with and be get a very good performance, solid performance as a result. I'd say try and use it, work it out, it's not going to work perfectly for first time for you, but you should be able to get the hang of it and it should help you go through and get good wins, more wins as a result, more possession of the ball, and that could be more a difference between the win and the loss, you having the ball and you getting more possession in a game. Anyway guys, I did, if you did enjoy, please leave a like rating and please subscribe. Anyway, I'll see you later, goodbye.